There's a newly released report from the Durham Police Department showing violent crime and property crimes decreased last year compared to 2021. And this afternoon, members of the city council receive a presentation on the numbers from the chief of police. CBS 17's Ben Boken is live at City Hall with a preview. Ben. Yeah, guys, the Durham Police Department provides quarterly updates to the city council on measures like staffing and crime. Now, in this latest report, homicides were actually down in Durham in 2022 by about 8 percent. But a staggering increase was rape increased by about 11 percent in 2022 uh, throughout Durham. But uh, earlier this week, I spoke with a Durham nonprofit called Shining Light in Darkness that aims to be a trusted partner for victims and survivors of sexual assault and domestic violence violence. Executive Director Ed Dudley believes not all crimes are reported by victims. We had a society that was reporting all of these crimes. I'm pretty sure the statistics would would cause all of us to think. According to the fourth quarter report, aggravated assault in Durham was down almost 19% in 2022. And the North Carolina Coalition Against Domestic Violence tells me that's that that statistic is encouraging because many people are getting more access to resources and help that they need. But advocates also tell me that these numbers and the crime overall, violent crime overall going down in Durham is encouraging, but more still needs to be done. Now behind me here at the City Hall at about one o'clock, the Chief of Police will be giving an update and a reading of those crime numbers. We're live here in Durham. Ben Boken, CBS 17 News. We look forward to hearing more on what the chief has to say. Ben, thank you.